A Comprehensive Guide to Growing Amaranthus Amaranthus, commonly known as amaranth, is a stunning and versatile flowering plant that adds vibrant colors and unique textures to gardens and landscapes. With its showy plumes of flowers and striking foliage, amaranthus is highly valued for its ornamental appeal and potential culinary uses. In this comprehensive guide, we will walk you through the step-by-step -step process of successfully growing amaranthus, from selecting the right varieties to caring for the plants and enjoying their beautiful blooms. Choosing Amaranthus Varieties Amaranthus offers a wide range of species and cultivars, each with its unique flower colors, leaf shapes, and growth habits. Some popular Amaranthus varieties include Amaranthus caudatus, Love Lies Bleeding, Amaranthus tricolor, Joseph's Coat, and Amaranthus cruentus, Purple Amaranth. Consider the desired height, flower color, and suitability to your climate when selecting your amaranthus varieties. Selecting the planting location. Amaranthus thrives in full sun to partial shade. Choose a location that receives at least six hours of direct sunlight per day for optimal growth and flowering. The soil should be well-draining, fertile, and enriched with organic matter. Amaranthus can tolerate a variety of soil types but prefers loamy soil with a pH range of 6.0 to 7.5. Planting Amaranthus Seeds or Seedlings Amaranthus is typically grown from seeds, which are readily available at nurseries or online. Follow these steps to plant amaranthus. Preparing the soil, clear the planting area of weeds, rocks, and debris. Loosen the soil to a depth of 8 to 10 inches, incorporating compost or well-rotted organic matter to improve soil fertility and drainage. Seeds Sell the amaranthus seeds directly in the garden after the danger of frost has passed or start them indoors 4 to 6 weeks before the last frost date. Scatter the seeds over the prepared soil and lightly press them into the soil surface. Cover with a thin layer of soil or vermiculite. Keep the soil consistently moist until germination occurs. Seedlings If using seedlings, dig a hole slightly larger than the root ball. Place the seedling in the hole, ensuring the top of the root ball is level with or slightly above the soil surface. Backfill the hole with soil, gently firming it around the seedling. Water thoroughly after planting. Watering and moisture requirements. Amaranthus prefers moderate moisture levels and performs best in well-drained soil. Water the plants regularly, providing enough water to keep the soil evenly moist but not waterlogged. During dry spells, increase the frequency of watering to prevent the plants from drying out. Applying mulch around the plants can help retain soil moisture and suppress weed growth. Providing proper care. To ensure healthy growth and abundant blooms, follow these care guidelines for amaranthus. Fertilization Amaranthus is a moderately heavy feeder and benefits from regular fertilization. Before planting, incorporate a balanced, slow-release fertilizer into the soil. As the plants grow, side dress with additional fertilizer or use a liquid fertilizer diluted to half strength every four to six weeks during the growing season. Mulching, apply a layer of organic mulch around the base of the plants, leaving a gap around the stems to prevent rotting. Mulch helps conserve soil moisture. Suppress weed growth and maintain a more even soil temperature. Support, some taller varieties of amaranthus may require support or staking to prevent them from bending or toppling over. Install stakes or use plant supports early in the growing season. Securing the stems gently with soft ties. Deadheading, while not necessary, you can remove spent flowers by cutting them back to the nearest set of healthy leaves. Deadheading may encourage continued blooming and prevent self-seeding. Although some gardeners appreciate the self-sown seedlings for future plants. Protecting from pests and diseases. Amaranthus is generally resistant to pests and diseases. However, they can occasionally be affected by aphids, leaf miners, or powdery mildew. Regularly inspect your plants and take appropriate measures, such as using organic pest control methods or applying fungicides if necessary. Good garden hygiene, including removing fallen plant debris, can help prevent disease issues. 
harvesting and culinary uses. Some amaranthus varieties, such as amaranthus cruentus, produce edible leaves and seeds. Harvest young leaves for salads or cook them like spinach. When the flowers mature, harvest the seeds for use in baking, as a grain substitute, or for sprouting. Be sure to research the specific variety and ensure it is suitable for consumption. Growing amaranthus is a rewarding and visually stunning endeavor that adds color and interest to gardens and landscapes. By following the step-by-step -step instructions outlined in this comprehensive guide, you can successfully cultivate amaranthus plants and enjoy their vibrant blooms. Embrace the process, provide proper care, and witness the beauty and versatility of amaranthus in your garden. Happy growing!